All right, so today we are going to be taking on the newest Super Bad Road stage on Global, which is stage 51 with uh, Planet Namek Saga. So without further ado, let's jump right into it here. And as far as the team goes, we got the double LR Full Power Frieza's uh, Int LR Super Saiyan Goku, the Fizz Second Form Frieza, the Exchange LR Vegeta and Goku, as well as the Tech Piccolo, and also the Free to Play Dodoria and Zarbon, which I've honestly never used before, but they seem like they would be quite good on the stage. So uh, we'll see what happens. So yeah, here we go. Jumping in. Hopefully it only takes us one attempt to get this done. I feel pretty good about this team, but at the same time, I'm not too sure how well we'll hold up defensively because uh, some of these units are not the best tanks. So anyways, starting here with the double Frieza, as you can see, the second form Frieza only has 83,000 defense, which is quite concerning. But on the bright side, he doesn't have any attacks in that second slot, which is good. So maybe we don't have to pop any items. You know what, just to be safe, let's still use an Icarus, just in case uh, the Goku at the end gets supered. And then we'll go for, uh, let's go for Dodoria first. Get a super for the full power Frieza. That's gonna be attack all for the second form Frieza. And then uh, I guess I'll give these to the Goku. Oh crap, <sighs> damn, I should have switched over to Zarbon for the last attack. That's my bad, that's my bad. I mean, it might not matter too much depending on how, how much damage we do with the uh, full power Frieza here. If we can get a crit with him, he might actually kill Zarbon. Or sorry, Dodoria. Um, right here. Okay, didn't quite get that. But still solid, solid damage. Can't complain. And then second form Frieza. Additional. <sighs> no additional there. Okay, that's fine. So maybe my Goku can get a crit. No, never mind. He has like level 2 crit, so... That's not gonna work. It's a good thing. <laughs> it's a good thing I popped the item, man, because that that was kind of rough. Um, okay, so for this rotation, we're still gonna go with Frieza in the first slot. Uh, let me see how much defense we have here. 129k for the uh, Vegeta here, but he does get more defense when he attacks, and he also raises attack defense with the super. So we should be okay, actually. I think we'll be fine. So let's try to finish off the Dodoria here. And then uh, let's get an 18 key super for the Vegeta and Piccolo. What does Piccolo do again? I remember he heals. Uh, let me see exactly what he does with the healing. 6% HP per Rainbow Key Sphere. Okay, so let's get him at least two Rainbow Key Spheres. That should be full HP now. Awesome. And there's the super, 182k. Not too bad. That, that's really not too bad. I can uh, live with that, for sure. All right, so there goes the Doria, and then the additional super. The full power Frieza hits so hard, man. He hits so hard. Like, I know the new LRs on JP. Yeah, oh my god, a third super. I know the new LRs on JP are mad impressive. I've been using the uh, Super Saiyan 4 Goku and Vegeta for a bit over the past couple of days. And I do agree that they're the best units in the game, right? But I feel like the Super Saiyan Goku and the Full Power Frieza are still not that far behind. You know, like, they're still... They gotta be top 5 right now still, even, even though it's been a couple months um, since their initial release. Actually, it's been like half a year since their initial release, but they're still super impressive to me, and uh, definitely don't sleep on them if you guys have been sleeping on them. I don't think a lot of people have. I'm just saying, don't forget about these uh, worldwide celebration LRs, you know? So on this turn, we have the Zarbon and Dodoria. I think I'm still going to keep the two freezes together, but uh, what Zarbon and Dodoria do is basically... Um, if you have a Frieza on rotation, they get a big attack and defense boost, and they also, I believe, have 
uh, attacks effective against all types if you are facing Planet Namek Saga category enemies, which obviously we are. So they should be doing some decent damage, and they also they should get guaranteed seal too, right? Yeah, they also seal the enemy if you have a Frieza in rotation. So uh, I'ma leave I'ma leave everybody where they are. In fact, I'm actually gonna pop a uh, Aider because I'm a little bit concerned about all the attacks. If they decide to attack us like like super attack us like five times, then we'll definitely be dead. So double item is fine, and then let's go for let's go for the uh, Ginyu because he definitely has the most HP and. I'm also going to try to seal, or not try, I'm going to seal the Ginyu with the Zarbon and the Doria. And since they get attacks effective against all, it doesn't really matter that we have type disadvantage, right? So here we go. I mean, we might be able to actually kill Ginyu with the full power of Frieza. Oh yeah, he's definitely dead. Okay, never mind. I guess we're sealing somebody else. Probably Jace, if he's still alive. The second form Frieza could actually kill everybody else. If we get an additional here, it's over. And maybe not over. Never mind. <laughs> I overestimated him a little bit, I think. <laughs> I thought he would hit harder than that. Um, I thought maybe we would get like some, some crits, possibly. Um, but no big deal. No big deal. You know, we're still well on our way. We should be able to finish this off in like two more turns at most and then we're moving on to the final stage wow that actually hit pretty hard okay um let's see i'm thinking we do goku and vegeta as the rotation here and we still have the icarus effect active so we should be okay we should be but i'm not like super confident in that uh Okay, let's put let's put Super Saiyan Goku here so he gets the guaranteed additional super, and then uh, we'll try to we'll try to finish off the Jace first, and then we'll go for Guldo. Hopefully, kill him, and then whoever's left, I guess, we'll just finish them off with the Frieza. Okay, three point nine mil. Not bad. This is still a 55% Goku. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to pull more than one copy during the Worldwide Celebration. Um, but the next time he comes back around, I'm probably going to try to rainbow him, which would be the anniversary, I guess. So yeah, during the anniversary, um, I'm not even going to have to try, actually, because I'm probably just going to spend so many stones on both the banners that uh, I'll end up rainbowing anybody I don't have rainbowed. So I need two more copies of the full power Frieza. I need four more copies of the Super Saiyan Goku, but uh, I'm pretty confident that both of them will be rainbowed by the end of the anniversary. Okay, there we go, perfect. So Guinea Force done, and uh, we have one more stage here, or one more fight. Now this is against just full power Frieza, I believe. Yes, just one enemy, so it's a little bit scary because obviously he's going to be extra, extra powerful. Now on the bright side, we do have full power Frieza who has type advantage. On the dark side, what's the opposite of bright side? On the negative, um, second form Frieza could be in a lot of trouble. So I'm very, very concerned here. So I'm going to double item once again. We're going to Whis and we're also going to Princess Snake. With the built up damage reduction, we should be okay. We should be okay, but I'm still honestly kind of concerned. Um, so hopefully things don't go too bad. There we go. I mean, if he's gonna super anybody, I would love if he supers the full power Frieza, obviously. If he supers second form Frieza, I fear that we might, in, we might be in a lot of trouble. Um, I don't think we'll die since we have two items, you know, stacked on top of each other, but I don't know, man. I haven't done this stage before. Obviously, it's our first run, so 
I'm always going to be a little bit nervous going into a stage for the first time. Okay, there's a crit. Oh my god. Oh, okay, okay. Yo, luckily, I did stack the items. If I... I feel like if I only did Whis, then... I mean, maybe you wouldn't die, but that would have been like 400k at least, right? Something like that. Yeah, so good call there. Good, good call <laughs> on my end. And uh, just to be safe, let's pop another Android 8. I don't think we had to use all these items. We did use a lot of items in this run, but it's better to be safe than sorry. And uh, it's better to get the clear out of the way first and then worry about like no item runs or you know, trying to be conservative with the items in the future. So I think this turn should actually be enough to finish off the Frieza. We got two supers from Super Saiyan Goku. We're gonna get a super from the uh, LR Vegeta. And I think that'll be, an yo, a rare crit from my Goku, guys. A very rare crit. Like I said, he has like level two crit in the hidden potential system right now. Oh, never mind. What am I saying? He gets guaranteed crit against Frieza's. Forgot about that. <laughs> that completely just slipped my mind. Okay, so, uh, just strike that from the record. I didn't say anything. Forget what I just said. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so dumb. Oh. I think our connection cut out for a second, but we're good. We're good. Okay. So there you go, guys. That is Planet Namek Saga Super Battle Road Stage uh, number 51. Um, as expected, you know, not not too bad. You know, we did have a few supers that like did quite a bit of damage to us. Maybe scared me a little bit for a second, but I knew we would get it done. So there you have it. The team once again: Full Power Frieza, LR Super Saiyan Goku, Second Form Frieza, Exchange Vegeta and Goku. Tech Piccolo for the healing and support, and also uh, the Tutoria and uh, Zarbon for also some support, I guess, and also just for fun. You don't really need to use them. You could replace them with somebody else that might be actually more effective. Uh, possibly the uh, third form Frieza from the Worldwide Celebration or something like that, but these guys do pretty well, I would say, especially if you run them consistently with a Frieza on rotation for the uh, seal every turn, right? And that's all I gotta say, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Good luck on your runs. And uh, let me know how, uh, how things go. And as always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel. If you're new, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you wanna stay up to date with all my latest content. And uh, until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.